Those will make life easier on yourself and take the money. We'll go. Oh, look at that. Mr. Rockstar Jared to the rescue again. <gasps> How's that dream working out for you, by the way? Sexier and a broke fuck wannabe in his 30s. I'm alright, Grace. Well, maybe you wouldn't be so lonely if you could find someone to spend more than 10 minutes with you. Whoa! So, you're talking to Fitzy before? And? What were you talking about? You're in there a while. Oh, talking about the damage done to his car. What was he asking you for? Well, I was working at the school that night. I wanted to know if I saw anything. Did you? <laughs> What's it to you? Ah, just curious. I saw a black car. Black Audi. Kind of like that one Paul drives. What's that supposed to mean? I know you went home last night. Is that a friend's place? Who's your friend? Just a friend, you wouldn't know him. <laughs> that sounds like a good alibi, dude. I wasn't there, right? Why are you being so uptight then? I had my reasons, but I wasn't there. That's not fair. Is it even my baby? How dare you! Of course it's your baby, you moron! This whole situation is fucked up and I don't know what to do, okay? Does he even love me? Yes. So much. Look at me. I love you. Just be patient, I will tell him, I promise. Dishes. <laughs> 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 Fuck that. Johnny didn't tell me shit. The decisions were made. Fuck you. Fuck me. Fuck you! They sent down here to take care of something and I'm gonna do with you or through you. Fuck that, I'm in. Fuck that? You are fucking in! Been sent down here to clean up your mess and you're gonna help me or the whole world's gonna come down on your fucking head. <laughs> he's fucking, he's a cock now. Oh, Frankie. 